Hello everybody and welcome to another video walkthrough brought to you by Mr. T Real Estate. This is Adam and I am here in the Hiwala. I am here to check out a stunning luxurious house. You can see how grand and how nice the house looks. We are on an elevated property, a beautiful house design, a fantastic uh, house plan, uh, well designed, 100 out of 100 marks to whoever who designed it, fantastic. I am highly impressed by this design and I think this house is not going to last for too long in the market. It's absolutely going to blow your mind. We are talking of 4,200 square feet approximately. We have seven and a half purchases of land. You can see the house in the background. You can see how big, how nice, how beautiful it looks. And uh, one of uh, the selling points of this house is also the parking space. You have parking for six vehicles. Can you believe it? We are a stone's throw to the main road, walking distance. We are in the Hivala, uh, very close to a lot of the amenities. And uh, there is some garden space as you enter. So you have uh, quite a bit of garden space in the front. We are elevated, so you can see uh, the road as well. Uh, So quite a bit of greenery around, beautifully landscaped. We have uh, four rooms and uh, we have to go up and down. So let's go inside, let's check out. I'm excited to take you through to this beautiful property which is up for sale. Before we go inside, look at the doors. Easy to hold, you have height, big, very palace-like, you know, just like you enter a palace, nice big long doors and uh, fully tiled, so come on in. So this here is the living space, it's fully tiled, it's white, it's big, it's large, it has open space, it has cross ventilation, lots of lights, you can see lots of lights and uh, very nice. I like the overall look and feel, I like the height, the design, the concept. So this is your living space here. And then, as you can see, I'm quite far away. I'm about 15 feet away and this is still lots of space. Very, very homely, very quiet. And like I said, you feel like you're already on the first level. Uh, you have basement car parking below. You also have this pantry space, which is quite nice. This is just an open pantry area here in case you want to do something quickly, but your dining space will be here gradually. You'll have the table and then easy to wash your hands, get back on the table. Kitchen is on the other side. We'll go there later. So you've got uh, two types of wood that's being used in this property. One is, uh, we all know the famous Nadun wood, and then we have Kempas, which is also a popular wooden material that is used in houses here. So again, lots of lights and uh, very interesting design, the fan. I've never seen one like that. So clearly uh, something new and something out of the ordinary. Nice to see uh, transparent uh, pieces here on the stairway. Enables the light to move around and it doesn't make the space look darker. Wooden stairway and uh, behind me is where you have the two rooms and the kitchen space. And this stairway here, it goes down. You can take your, the stairway, you can basically go down to the garage or the basement. And if you park your vehicle there, you can take the stairs and come upstairs. Or you can just come from the front. Uh, talking of the location, we are in Dehivala. We have, uh, you know, it's a very prime spot. You're very close to the main road. You're walking distance. Everything is good. Location, area, neighborhood, 100 out of 100. So, we we'll start with the room on this level. Any house design, you must have a room where the living and dining room is. Could be for visitors, could be for an office, could be for anything, but you need to have a room and that's where we're going now. So come on over here. And in doing so, you also need to make sure you have uh, the washroom. 
just outside the room. You need to make sure you have the washroom outside the room. So let's go in and have a look at the room first and then we'll go into the washroom. Let's go check out the room. Thick doors, I like how thick it is. Yep, it's really thick. So that's nice. And then we have uh, the room. Decent size, it's quite large. And you have uh, lots of uh, ceiling lights. You can see four of them. And then there's also uh, the provision for the air conditioner. You have a balcony area as well, so that's nice. Fully tiled. Office, library, study, visitor's room. There is a separate light here if in case you want to have a table or something. And uh, yeah, it's a white colored light. So let's go check out the washroom. This here is the washroom again, very nice. You have uh, the cement polish uh, here, then you have separate uh, texture over here. You have black as a theme, you have black tap, you have black uh, handle, you have uh, black shower. Now, something interesting about this is this is adjustable. You can lower it if you want and you can increase the height. So this is something we've not seen in a lot of the properties where you can increase and decrease the height of the shower. So this is, uh, I'd buy this house just for this shower. It's that cool. I like it so much. And then you have the sink and all of that. Let's go check out the kitchen space now. So the kitchen space is just next door, right next to the room and that's, that's good. You don't have to do too much of running. And it has, all of them have this wooden frame around so it gives a good uh, feel. You have the door, which the main door, which also has this wooden frame and then it's nice. So we've got, uh, we saw a pantry area in the room, uh, in the living room, just outside near the dining area. And then we also have uh, this closed kitchen. We also have a kitchen space uh, downstairs. And we also have uh, a small pantry area, in case you want to have parties on the rooftop. Stay with me because the rooftop is something else. You have to walk, look at it, you have to see it. So kitchen area here has a balcony, well ventilated. It's very well ventilated, I must tell you that. I could feel the breeze and uh, that's quite nice. You have a small balcony space outside and uh, you get some of the fittings all built in. So <laughs> nothing to spend here in terms of uh, uh, doing up anything. You just bring your electronics, the fridge and all that. Before we go upstairs, we need to check out the basement. So let's go down and then we'll go up. This is quite nice. I like the overall setup here. Uh, you come right down and then you have a small pantry area over here. Also have a garden strip. So very large uh, basement. Now for a seven and a half perched property to have parking for six is an absolute bonus. I've done videos with six and a half perch, 10 perch, 15 perch, 20 perch. They still don't give you this kind of space for parking. So if you're a car person, if you're somebody who likes cars, if you're someone who likes space, forget about cars. If you want to just play a game of cricket or you want to have some kind of, you know, get together or chit chat or whatever, fantastic place. This is huge. This is big. There is space for six car parks according to the plan. So I'll just walk you through. You have all of this space, all of this space, just amazing. You don't have an issue with, uh, you know, smaller road or anything of that kind. There's so much of space here. This is just mind blowing. 
So all this space is available. So we have a garden strip here. On a seven and a half perched property, again, let me reiterate, to have this type of space for parking and to have this much a garden space. I showed you garden space at the entrance and I showed you this strip here. If you're talking of having a puppy, you're talking of having a dog, pet, cat, etc., you know, you can still manage with all of that. You have space to park six vehicles, you have 4,000 square feet, you have four rooms, you've got a rooftop, you've got almost four pantry areas, uh, three big ones, and fantastic. I think the design in itself is a seller. So now that you've seen the basement, you've seen the ground floor, let me now take you back upstairs to check out the other three rooms. So I'll see you in the living area. Alrighty, so we are back again inside the house. Let's go upstairs and let's uh, check out the other three rooms. We have to go to the rooftop as well. So. This is where you have the nest. I always like to call it the nest because this is where you have your privacy. This is where you have the bedrooms and this is where guests usually don't come. They stay downstairs. They are kept, they're kept entertained downstairs. So this is a seven and a half perch property. Naturally, you will see that size is well utilized. This space is kept at bare minimum, which is good because you're not going to spend much time here, but you have enough to do uh, maybe a console. There is a nice little wallpaper here. Textured wall, looks very pretty, has a bit of a natural feeling because the design is uh, very much like the roots of trees, that's, that's the impression I get when I see it. So nice long piece, could have kept a blank wall, but then it would look too dull. So nice to have uh, some taste, some flavor in the property, which is good. So before we go to uh, the two rooms to my right, I'll start off with the master bedroom, which is to the left. So the master bedroom in a good house design is always near the stairway. Right, so this is the master bedroom. Big, master bedrooms have to be big. This is quite big. I like the size you can see, I'm standing at halfway. There's a long master bedroom here. This is like a small studio apartment. You can put everything here. You can put your bed, you can put your living area, you can put a dining table, you can even set up a small kitchen space if you want to. So this is quite long and quite nice and this is beautiful. Very pretty. Quite a lot of ceiling lights. I think uh, there's about eight. Yeah, there's about eight ceiling lights. There's also a balcony and uh, you can see the outside, you can see the greenery, great view. Again, similar type of textured wall, so that's nice. The house has a CCTV camera as well and there are certain elements that have been fixed in like uh, shelves and uh, there is a built-in cupboard in one of the rooms. So, quite large, quite big, fancy is the word, and luxuriously done. Seven and a half perch property, 4,100 square feet. It cannot get better than this. This is by far one of the best, if not the best, seven and a half perch property you can see in Colombo. We are in the Hivala. There is also the balcony area here. Decent sized balcony. I won't go out. We have a lot to show you, but you can get the idea. It's nice view, residential area. Now to check out the washroom. So let's check out the master washroom.
got one room covered, we got two more rooms to cover on this level. Let us have a look and then we will head to the rooftop. There is a lot to see in the rooftop, so stay with me. Two rooms on either sides, we will start with the one to my left. Very similar to what was on the ground floor, but I guess this is a bit larger. We have more space, lots of space, quite nice, it's a lot of space and good height, a lot of light as well. Uh, you do not feel in any way uh, claustrophobic or you do not feel compact. You feel at home and you feel you have got space. So, you can do a lot here, you can put your bed, you can put on a lot of wardrobe space, you can even put on a study table, you can put uh, so many things. I love the overall look and feel of the room, white walls, complementing tiles, light colored, creamish to be precise and uh, looks nice, looks beautiful. Almost the size of a master bedroom if you are going to live in an apartment, this room is pretty much it is bigger than a master bedroom of some apartments that I have seen. So, this is quite nice, quite a good benefit because it is only one of the rooms, it is not the master bedroom. The master bedroom we saw it was huge, this here is impressive. So, we have got to see the third and final room, but before I take you inside, I have to tell you this house has three phased electricity. So, enough to take up the whole load. Third room, smallest on this level. I like the texture again on the wall, the consistency of the design has been maintained throughout. It is the same design, it is the same texture, so it is nice. It gives the feeling that you have a touch of, uh, I do not know, it, for me this looks like roots of, uh, of, uh, of a tree or a plant. It has a rooty, rooty design, but it is nice, it feels attached to nature. So, small room, but still enough to play around. The good thing. You have built in cupboard and if you want to set up a mirror, plug point etc. You have that and then there is also a balcony area. Time now to check out the rooftop or should I say the entertainment area. This is one of the best spots of the house, my favorite because kitchen you are going to cook, bedroom you are going to sleep. This is where you are going to spend a lot of time, this is your TV area, this is your entertainment zone. Beautiful, I love this spot. You can set up your TV, projector, video games, speakers, you can have your home theatre system, all of that. I like the overall look and feel and the design. You have, you know, similar wooden sort of ceiling, uh, black lights, uh, warm white uh, being the colour, uh, the design, the whole idea behind it, the whole concept. This is like the, the zone, you know, you may have visitors downstairs, it does not matter. Your time here, you can still spend it, you can still do whatever you want. So, wooden flooring, we did not see uh, wooden flooring in any part of the house as far as I remember. We had tiles as you entered, the rooms had tiles, the basement had tiles. Uh, this is where you have, uh, this is called, uh, this is campus, the wooden feeling, uh, the wooden uh, flooring, it is a uh, campus and uh, again you have this cement uh, polish uh, design here, very nice. Always goes well when you have a warm white light with this cement finish, it always goes well as opposed to the brilliant white, uh, the daylight uh, color, always looks nice and then you have a theatre like uh, feeling that you get when you look up into the wooden ceiling. So, that is very pretty, very cute. That is not all with this roof terrace. There is also outdoor spaces. So, we will start with the outdoor space to my left. We 
have a lot of space here. You have so much of space here. Have a look. And then you also have a lot of space here. There is so much of space. Amazing, isn't it? This is a seven and a half perch property, ladies and gentlemen, and we have so much of space. We've got 4,100 square feet. We've got parking for six. Nowadays, parking has become such a requirement, such a requisite to buying houses that this house gives you so much value. I'm truly impressed with this setup. I think uh, whoever's going to take it, you'll thank Mr. T Real Estate for being able to bring this to you because this is a fantastic deal. You have to call us on 076-281-5146. Uh, for more details, there is one more side to see though. That's the other side. We've seen uh, one side of the roof terrace. We've got two roof terraces, which is between the entertainment zone. So on either side, you've got a roof terrace. Let's go see the other side. Similar, identical, same size, same layout. Beautifully done. There are a few differences though. There are a few variations, if I may say so. You have a seating space here, and you also have, I know this is an English video, but uh, if you want to have like a bi area, I'd like to say this is a chuti kitchen here. A cute, chuti little kitchen, small one. Beautifully spaced in. You have a sink, you have storage space. You also have uh, something like an infrared cooker. You also have space to keep some glasses and things. So if you want to set up a mini bar, you want to have a small party. Fantastic property, truly mind blowing. I love it. I think I'll hands down recommend it to you. Come over, have a look. This house is not going to stay in the market. You'll see it if you're watching this video late after it was posted, you'll see the words sold. I'm pretty sure I'm that confident of this property getting sold very fast. So call us on 076-281-5146, 076-281-5146. For more details, check on the description below and send this to everyone who's living in Mount Lavinia, the Hivala, further down, Rathmalana, uh, Papiliana, wherever around this area who wants to get close to Colombo. This is a fantastic property. You're talking walking distance to the main road and well-placed, well-designed, well-located. Everything is beautiful. Parking for six. How often do you get a house in these types of areas with parking for six vehicles? So that's something to keep in mind. Uh, don't forget to like, share, comment, and uh, I'll see you soon on another video. This is Adam signing off for now. Thank you for watching.